Hey y'all, it's your girl Mila, and in this video, I am going to teach you how to do a simple, sexy, smoky eye. Let's get this party started. So before applying my foundation, I am putting on the Body Shop's primer with my fingers, and this will help smooth out the skin and make my foundation last longer. Then I'm applying Ella Masca Skin Base Foundation in shade number 12 with Real Techniques buffing brush all over my face. I want it nice and flawless and I want my coverage to be solid. For the areas that I need extra help, I'm using NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer in shade Ginger. And I am patting it on with my fingers to keep the coverage and blend it into the skin. Once my base is all done, I set it with Max Blotting Powder in medium dark with a makeup pad and this really helps seals in the base and makes your makeup last long. Then I'm contouring with Max Sculpt Powder and I'm using Joe Fresh's blush brush to apply it on. Um, just along my temples and my hairlines, just under the cheekbones and the sides of the bridge of my nose and I like to squeeze the brush a little bit. Then I'm warming up my contour with the Makeup Store's Bronzer in Sun and um, a stippling brush that I got from a makeup convention or makeup show by Crown Brushes. And this just helps me feel a little bit more sexy. For the cheeks, I don't want any obvious color, but I do want a little bit of a, a healthy glow. So I'm applying Max Gingerly Blusher with a 129 blush brush. And before I fill in my brows, I like to groom them downwards. So when I'm applying on Shu Omar's brow pencil in Seal Brown, I'm able to get it directly onto the skin. So nice full brows is key for a sexy smoky eye. Makes it look a little bit more classy, if you know what I'm saying. Then this is the tricky part. I'm using Max Graph Black Pencil. Um, inside the bottom waterline and also the top waterline. This specific pencil is wax based so it's designed to stay in there and not dissolve because you know how it is when you put a pencil on the inside of your eye, you blink and it disappears. So this does stay on longer and this technique not only makes your eye color pop but it also makes your lashes look more voluminous. Then I'm applying Max Paint Pot in Eclair all over my eyelid with my fingers and my bottom lash line and this helps the eyeshadow go on a lot smoother and last longer because it is water resistant. Then my handy dandy Stila Natural Eyeshadow Palette. I'm using bare eyeshadow on my brow bones to highlight with a MAC 224 brush. Then sandstone eyeshadow with the same brush along my eyelid and my bottom lash line. And this tissue ninja technique is really important because it does catch the fallout of the eyeshadow. To create that really dark effect around my eyes, I'm using ebony eyeshadow with an eyeshadow brush. And I'm patting it on to really get it dark. And then I'm going to soften it with the same blending brush I was using earlier to create that smoky effect. And the thing with the smoky eye, the smoky eye is a technique, it's not a, a color. So this helps make it look really seamless and flawless, hence why it's called a smoky eye. Then to bump up the inner corners, I'm using champagne eyeshadow. I'm just applying it on with my fingers to get nice and dense and um, to give it that glowy highlighter effect. And I curl my lashes with Shu Mars Lash Curler on the root middle and the tip of my lashes to get like a super mega curl. Then I'm using Max Factors False Lash Effect Mascara on my bottom lashes first and then my top lashes and I apply about two to three coats because I don't have any eyelashes. And then I'm using MAC Sanctually Stylish Pro Longwear Lip Pencil all over my lips. This sets water resistant and 
and Max Lux Natural um, Mineralized Rich Lipstick, which apparently lasts long. And I just pat it on to give it that Angelina Jolie, you know, nude effect. And you're ready to get your fierceness on. Get it, girl. Thanks for watching my video. Please like and subscribe. And if you want to see any more makeup tutorials, click on the following links below or check out my channel. Music by VJ Elliott. He is the man. Go subscribe to his channel. And to know the products that I use in this video, all of that information will be found in the description box down below. See you next time. Bye.